Oh my God! I was with Corinna once, <laughs> and when she was Stop! when she, when she was no, this was in the vlog when she was dating Todd. Oh yeah. And and like they were just goofing around, like fooling around, and like Corinna put her legs back, mm-hmm. and like Todd kind of went in between her legs a little bit, like as a joke, like a, a little over her belly button, and Corinna just let one go right on Todd's <laughs> face. Oh man! And one time. That's why she gets I, the big money when she streams. Wait, no, no, no. Listen, this one's this one's even better. This is like a better version of that story. One time, me and Todd were like uh, fooling around. And we were butt ass naked, and I was like bent over in like a doggy position, and I like <laughs> spread my ass and was like, "Is there like an ingrown hair right here?" And he literally got you know up in there, and I just <laughs> let one rip right into his face. <laughs> butt ass That's naked, fucking crazy, <laughs> crazy you than know, you thinking wait, the wait, future wait. self is in your closet, <laughs> <laughs> so you don't want to bother him. No, bro, you I know, think that's insane. But you know that like David's. Never like pooped in front of Liza or even farted. I don't no, even know. Like, I don't do that either. I agree. I'm with David on that. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I've never done that. I wouldn't do I that either. I just feel like I get very close to my significant other, and we're like at a point where it just doesn't matter. Sure. And I and like I t- if my I boyfriend's think that's gonna totally stick cool. his dick in my ass, why can't I fart in front of him? Do you know what I'm saying? Okay. So she's had anal. <laughs> one is pleasurable. One is fucking gross. Farting is. Why is it gross? <laughs> because it's disgust. Farting is just disgusting. Does it make you think I'm less attractive? It doesn't make no. You- it, no, it doesn't make me think you're less so attractive. What's the problem? But it, it, especially when you do it during like a moment where you're fooling around naked, like so that's supposed to be like this like like pleasurable sexual moment, and then you ruin it by like see, but it wasn't farting. ruined. It, like that, that's when it, that's when I go, oh my god, this can happen at any given time. No, 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 no. But that's what you're understanding is it wasn't ruined. It was actually like really fucking hysterical because then we both burst it out in laughter for probably a good five minutes. No, that's great. And then continued to have sex. Do you know what I'm saying? Like it was so a very funny, him. humorous moment. Yes. Okay. And I feel like I've had that happen a lot. I mean, you're you're taking a risk there. Yeah. Oh hell no. You know, no, if no, a guy's not gonna let me fart in front of I him, think, yeah. Okay. I think, I think that's Corinna. Th- that makes sense. Hell no. Corinna's looking for a guy that will let her fart on his face, and that's fair. No, 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 no. no love no, me no. at my worst, or don't love me at all. Yeah. No. You look like if you want to see my ass, let me pass gas. <laughs> 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 that's that's what Corinna lives by, and it makes sense. It makes sense. Now that we're on the whole sex topic, there's this girl that went to one of my elective classes in high school. And the story was that she was having sex with a guy, and then <gasps> and, have one of these. and then she shat all over his chest and all mm. over him on, on complete accident. And it went around the high school. That's the worst story to go around high school. You, you want to know the story that went around my high school? What? This girl was at a party, and for whatever reason, they thought it'd be a good idea to start fucking on the pool table in front of everybody. And Ooh. then they did anal, and she shit all over this guy's like thousand dollar oh, pool table my god in front, of, in front of the party and her name was like whitney or something so they called her like shitty whitney or i don't even know they gave her some really weird nickname okay she put herself in that situation fucking no, in front 100%. of everybody in the pool table how can you both have a story like that you don't have I, one there was i, I feel have like tons because yeah. every time you ever meet anybody like one of the first stories like any sexual story you like you talk to anybody it's always a shitting story mm. i've met a lot of friends that are like yeah my friend they used to shit on each other Wait, what? Yeah, I, like I, I actually just weird out. No, but I feel like away. if you asked anybody from high school if they have like a story like that, everyone would have something. Yeah, everyone has one story where somebody pooped themselves. Yeah. In a sexual act. Have you ever given a blumpkin? Yes. Oh my god, you have. What? I've also given. Do you a... know what that is, Jay? Yeah, I think so. Wow, what? I've also given a rusty trombone. So Corinna's given a blumpkin and a rusty. <laughs> Excuse me, what? <laughs> a rusty trombone. Do you know trombone. what either of those are? Well, I don't know what a rusty trombone is. First of all, let's talk about this blumpkin. A blumpkin is where you give someone a blowjob while they're taking a poop. Yes. Have you ever done that, Natalie? No. I, explain that to me, Corinna. How did how does that happen? And what part of that turns somebody I mean, on? It's also it's it's goes hand in hand with the whole farting thing. It's just like we think it's funny. Someone's shitting, and I'm not someone. He's shitting, and <laughs> some he's random, just like some oh. random guy we found is shitting. <laughs> what about the smell? Blow. Um, yeah, I just wouldn't be able to be like. It wasn't that bad. I feel like I guess if it was smellier, I would have been like no. But I guess it just wasn't a. Was smelly it a DJ poop. that was vegan? No, 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 <laughs> no. The I think I mean that one was just. It was, was it a I DJ that I was didn't, vegan? I sucked it, but I didn't suck it till it <laughs> okay. exploded. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. But like the rusty trombone, like what is that? that I've never great. heard of that. A rusty trombone is where you eat a guy's ass while you're jerking them off. And, and which DJ did you do that with? Not a DJ, no. And are DJs better at sex? I'm sorry, what part of this conversation did you think I was going to love and want to be a part of? <laughs> I know, I know. David literally <laughs> called Natalie over for this conversation well, while she- You're fire and ice. I think it's like the-, the, the Okay, rude. How do you feel about the rusty trombone? Okay, you've Natalie. eaten ass before? <laughs> no, I haven't eaten ass before. <laughs> I mean, no, you guys are just very different in, in those. I mean, I'm very different from Corinna, too. I think we're all very different from Corinna, but it's- 
Hey. I'm sorry. I've never. I've. I'm actually we love never, you for who you are. That's the best. Would you part. ever let a girl eat your ass? Never, ever in a fucking trillion years. Why? It's great. That's so gross. Okay. I feel like I don't know. But what why kind do of- you think it's gross? Like, tell me honestly, because I will t- debunk everything. Now, why is it gross? Have you ever seen the, the the stuff that comes out of my ass? I would never ever <laughs> right. subject anyone to that. Okay, but the stuff that comes out of your ass isn't on your ass. You don't know that. Yeah, you okay, don't know well that. I do. So when, I, okay, first of all, you have to realize when you, it's just like. With anything, you don't just like go into it randomly. Like before, I ate his ass. It wasn't just like he had ran a mile and took a shit. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, he yeah. just showered straight he, out of the bathroom. Well, he sh- we took a bath first of all. That's like much different than a shower. A fucking bath where your ass cheeks are kind of like spread in the water. And then also, I made him let both of them actually let me shave their ass. So there was like it was literally just licking skin. So you so shaved wait, his, you ass. Shave his ass. <laughs> yeah, and then you. That's ate some it foreplay. Out? Yes. Hey, let's let's, uh, let's pause now and jump into an ad right here. <laughs> <laughs> that that was your foreplay. Oh it was, you shaved no, his ass. No, it wasn't foreplay, but it was just like, hey, I'm gonna sh-. like I I did it with two boyfriends. Hey, actually. I'm going to shave your ass now. No, like, it wasn't I don't like, yeah, know no. what part it, about that would get me aroused in any way. I, that I was wasn't just, the foreplay. But I don't. How do you fucking? How do you even ask that question? I want to shave your ass. See, that's why I don't. I think we're so different because like with my boyfriends it's so close it's not even like a weird thing i was close with my girlfriend i would yeah. never no, be like hey weren't. take this razor and shave my no, ass you were but you weren't in that way because you couldn't even fart around her okay it was just like fair but that was i was just sh- like let me shave your ass and he was like what i'm like yeah let me shave your ass and he was like oh okay like it, it wasn't <laughs> okay like, weird. fair enough okay i can now that she said it like that yeah when she goes let me shave your ass i'm i'm sure. actually down for you to shave my ass right, all right now. Let's do it. <laughs> no but then after that don't you feel a little bit better like first of all it's soaked you know what i'm saying there's no hair for anything to be stuck to it's a clean ass well yeah you're literally that, just maybe. licking skin at that point do you know what i'm saying okay i i fuck with that i don't know if i fuck with that because i just feel like I'm also a very like over analytical person, so I feel like the whole time I'm just gonna be like, "He's what if he shits in my mouth? Like, Why would he shit in your mouth? <laughs> All I, would... I don't know. Like it's not like he was intentionally gonna do it, but what if he accidentally has to fart or shit? I, or I something? mean, I like, think he would make you stop. I don't know. I just I feel like hope, personally, but... it was no you did different. it. You fucking blew a fart right well, in yeah. his face. <laughs> uh, maybe he could have done it back to me, but um, there's too many like unpredictable outcomes. Yeah, you there. never no, know. No, I just feel like poor Todd. I mean, I, I would hope that if they were like, "I'm gonna <laughs> fart while you're eating my ass," they wouldn't let me continue to eat their ass but at the same time i hope this is one of those podcasts no, that a kid a kid shows to his parents <laughs> to show him what this podcast is all about <laughs> and just the fucking mom and dad are sitting there like this is what you've been listening to all i'm saying is when i ate ass it was no different than sucking a dick because it was very clean and it didn't taste like anything that's, that's all i'm saying it, t- it was no different than sucking a dick fair